everyone this is elango there was a question posted by mr rahul in arbunpro.com uh, the question was uh, uh, how to start an embedded systems company an embedded system company is going to be one another company but you have to actually know the purpose on why you are starting a company first of all so you need plans you need budgeting you need the uh, intellectual capacity it's not just you it is about the team which you which is going to actually develop that product basically you are going to cater for which industry this is one big question that you have to answer or you are going to do some kind of a consulting helping other companies to actually develop and design embedded systems or you are going to actually be a product company develop something which is completely new you are going to invent something so this kind of categorization this kind of analysis you have to do the second thing is you have to find out or you capable of uh, meeting the industry set standards for example if you are going to develop some embedded system uh, or devices for medical equipment industry you should be well versed in the standards that they require for example the uh, fda uh, uh, or uh, whatever you know the medical industry standard they set for actually you know developing this uh, uh, embedded system for that particular purpose you should be known thorough on it for example uh, you cannot just put some sensor which is available free in the market you cannot do that you have to go for the particular sensor that should be some kind of a quality check that should be a reliability check you should always give a warranty for whatever device you are going to manufacture and that should be a basis for it simply you cannot say it's going to work for one year that should be a proper substantiation for that and you have to develop device that way and moreover you should have a team of engineers basically starting from mechanical engineer an electrical engineer an electronics engineer even if you are going to be a very small startup with 5 or 5 to 10 people in capacity all should be expertise not just starters you got to know there should not be some freshers it should be a team of well equipped thoroughly thought uh, people uh, team of people only through that you can actually start an embedded systems company just like that you cannot do keep on doing the experimentation so please uh, i request you uh, to uh, uh, ask questions which is more specific so that i can target those questions and answer in brief because the time given to us is only 3 minutes in urban pro to give this kind of explanations please do follow me in urban pro in the name of ilango pogarendi uh, for uh, more questions and answers thank you so much